Hey everybody, this is Shachaf. Uh, I'm here with an update, and this video is about adoption. While I believe every use case is stronger with optional privacy, our focus in you know, the next year or so is around RWA, DeFi, and AI. So today I'll speak mostly about RWA adoption. We kicked off May with huge news. Cody was selected by the European Central Bank to be one of its pioneer partners and to work on the design of the digital euro. Sounds big. We will work alongside global powerhouses like Accenture, KPMG, and Tata. Yes, we are building the future of European money. This comes after our successful participation in the digital shekel project with the Bank of Israel, providing Koti its go-to name for privacy in CBDCs. Privacy is the missing layer in public blockchains as essential infrastructure for the next generation of CBDCs. Koti's fast, scalable on-chain privacy keeps sensitive data confidential without compromising usability. Our work in the digital euro isn't just a proof of a concept in a sandbox. We're plugging into ECB's infrastructure to problem solve with them. We aim to prove that when governments and central banks need privacy tech, they can trust they come to Coti. What can be expected out of it? Well, if Coti will be part of the infrastructure that these national programs have, it's huge. We're proving ourselves in the international arena with our work on RWAs. We are catching momentum specifically in the Middle East and Northern Africa area. As founding members of the Saudi Arabia AI and Blockchain Center, we've begun to engage top leaders in discussions around tokenizations on a national scale across MENA and broader Africa. The RWA summit we participated in, remember that round table we hosted? It attracted many, many VIPs including royalty. The easing of regulation and the regulation clarity around tokenization means RWAs are closer than ever to be on a national scale not seen before. Following the RWA Summit Roundtable, our uh, Chief Ecosystem and Partnership Officer Joshua Maddox was invited back to the Royal Palace in a more private manner uh, to be hosted by His Highness Sheikh Awad. Joshua had the opportunity to speak directly to His Highness about the merits of tokenization, and we are actively now in discussions about multiple projects. Following Dubai, we were invited to um, the mayor of New York City first ever digital asset summit. This was an invite only closed door strategy session for 60 of our industry's top blockchain builders. We were part of it. Mayor Adams made it clear New York City wants to be a global crypto hub. Regulation, adoption, and innovations were all on the table. Privacy had a moment on the stage as Mayor Adams described the city's vision that included a confidential blockchain for city services, citing birth certificates, property records, taxes, and so on. Just imagine that. The event organizer, Richie Hacker, thank you, Richie, mentioned Cody in his opening speech, recognizing our leadership in bringing all these minds together. This is a very exciting signal for Cody's growing international profile. Now, what can be expected out of Dubai, New York, etc.? Well, hopefully, a series of MOUs and partnerships on a massive scale. <clears throat> now, on a more of a narrative note, Cody was featured prominently in Messari's recent report on decentralized confidential computing, DECC, or what some may call Privacy 2.0. If you haven't read it yet, the link uh, is in the comments below. Misari is a highly reputable research firm known for their detailed and trusted analysis that serves the industry. The report takes a deep dive into privacy in Web3 and cites Cody directly as a leader in this space, highlighting our use of garbage circuits for high-performance, scalable privacy on-chain. But you already know all of that. Now, this isn't just a mention, it's recognition of Cody as a builder of real production grade privacy infrastructure. The report is a milestone that puts Cody uh, on the map for developers, investors, and institutions who care about the next wave of Web3 infrastructure, about the new era. Now, Treasury V2 is just around the corner. This is the first full integration of the Cody V2 network into the Treasury. It's more than just an upgrade. It's about activation and the, activ the activation of the full power of the Cody V2 ecosystems. Users, uh, as yourselves, will now be able to choose between ERC-20 deposits uh, and Cody V2 deposits on our new purpose-built chain. 
All the features you already know, like top-ups, GCOTI boosts, locking periods, rewards, remain fully operational and as you know it. There is no action required from users except for one critical thing that if you haven't done, please finish this video and do it now. You can even pause the video and do it now. Link your MetaMask wallet. If you're linked, you're in. Simple as that. Now, I discussed RWA. Let's talk about DeFi for a bit. Uh, because there's a lot of uh, activities happening behind the scenes right now. You will see the results pretty soon. Uh, we've seen additional tokens made available to the Cody network, including you know, USDC, as you know, but we now also have wrapped ETH and wrapped Bitcoin. Uh, this means that we are expanding the utility of Cody, and trading is now available through Carbon. Uh, and as this evolution continues, select exchanges will also begin preparing for the transition to Cody V2. Now, we've launched the network. We've bridged the uh, important assets. Now we're giving the community the tools to unlock value with Treasury V2. But it's not only that. We've discussed the vision that we have in Cody around the new era of privacy, the new era of infrastructure. From that, we're moving to adoption to prove this use case through RWA, DeFi, and AI. And what comes next is actually your ability to earn from it to join this revolution. So Treasury V2 is just the beginning, believe me. Um, let's say hello to new partners that have joined us in May. So Encrypt added support for Cody Network to its 200,000 users. Encrypt is a DeFi wallet uh, from the powerhouse of my Ether wallet. It brings more than visibility and more momentum for Cody. We've also welcomed Third Web to the Cody Mainnet, one of the leading platforms in Web3 development that serves uh, 70,000 users who can now tap into Cody privacy first infrastructure, which will lead to more adoption. Now, as I said at Cody, we're very serious about RWA's DeFi and AI, and we're working very hard to provide this essential infrastructure for the new era of innovation. The bottom line is that Cody isn't watching the future happen. We're designing it today, and we invite you to join us for this journey. Thank you.